This means that all of the evidence and all of the witness testimony has been put forward to the jury. After the defense rested their case today, the judge sent the jury home. He wants them to be refreshed so they can return on Monday to begin deliberating. After the state rested earlier this week, the defense had a chance to present their case today. They called two witnesses who didn't want to be on camera, but the men were both longtime friends of James Worley. They both testified about Worley's motorcycle. The state is trying to prove it was Worley on his motorcycle who ran Sierra Joggin off the road. The defense is trying to prove to the jury that Worley's motorcycle was old and unreliable and broke down in the same cornfield where police believe Sierra was abducted from. Once he got the motorcycle started and he was driving down the road, it wouldn't stall. Is that accurate? It always stalled when he stopped? Basically, when you slow down, sometimes it would stop. Okay, and when, when it would stall, how long would it be stalled for? Usually until you give it another kick start. And... The defense also submitted one piece of evidence, a DVD with a full browser history from Worley's computer. In the state's case, they focused on porn sites Worley visited. The defense told the jury there was more than just porn on his computer. So Monday morning, the jury will be right back here at the Fulton County Courthouse. They'll hear closing arguments from the state and the defense. Then they'll get some instruction on how the deliberation process should work, and then they'll begin deliberating. Of course, we will be on verdict watch here and let you know when that verdict comes in. Reporting from Fulton County, Michelle Zapata, WTOL 11.